What's up guys, Liam here and welcome back to LSJ TV. Thank you so much for tuning in today for this week's extra video. If you are new here, my usual upload schedule is Wednesday and Sunday. Obviously today is Tuesday and so here is an extra video. We've stripped it back so this is a slightly different kind of video to my normal kind of, you know, jolly music content and all that kind of stuff. But I think it is very important what I have to say. So if you are Looking forward to the video, please do me a favour, drop a like, comment down below, subscribe if you are new, welcome to the family. I hope you guys do enjoy this, let me know your thoughts on the raw content in the comment section down below and enjoy the video. So we have a half chicken, lemon and herb, of course, with one side of sweet potato mash. Normally I would have a side of chips alongside that, but to be honest, life is too short to not have nandos at all. So you can have Nando's, but just be tame with it. Those who go and have a butterfly chicken because they think it is better for you, I mean, there's an argument to say that it is, but if you look on my fitness pal, there's about 50 calories difference and like one gram of fat difference. If I prefer to have a half chicken, I'm gonna have a half chicken. And I'm not gonna not go to Nando's because body power is in a couple of weeks. You know, well, it's in like three weeks, you know? Weight loss is going fine. We went, we had a sick session and really, really, really good session as actually, by the way. One of the best back sessions I've had for a long time. We just smashed it and we like intense session. It was really, really good. Um, so thank you, Jake. I know you're watching this, so much love, mate. It was nice to see you for the first time in like, what, two months? So that's another reason why Oh God, excuse me. Um, I'm currently sat in the park and I'm drinking a monster, so that's hence the burps. Um, it would have been silly of me to to not go to Nando's because, yeah, I'm on a diet and all this kind of stuff, but it's just chicken, and you know, as long as you don't go don't go nuts with with like sauces and you don't go nuts with like sides and you know uh, full fat tango or fanta or whatever to go with it, then you know. You, you're fine really, you don't really have to stress about it that much and it would be just so stupid of me to not go for the sake of that when I haven't seen Jake in like two months. Like, life's too short, enjoy yourself. If you want to go to Nando's with your mate, find a way to fit that into your diet. It, it, it really shouldn't matter as, as much as it does to, I mean, credit to the people that can't go, that can go months and months on end without stuff like that and contest prep and all that kind of stuff. But I'm not on contest prep. I'm just trying to lose a few pounds. And if that sets me back like two days, like, I'll just do a hundred calories more card. I don't know. I will figure it out. I will fit it in one way or another and I will not be worrying about it so it is currently 6 p.m. on Saturday it's bank holiday weekend I've got nothing to do Charlotte's gone to a bar with um, her mate Jake's gone off out and so I'm on my one here in Birmingham and I figured I may as well make the most of it because it's not very often you actually get a chance to like, I'm just sat in a park. Look, I'm just sat up against a tree in a park. It's 6 p.m. I'm sat in a t-shirt and shorts, and it's bloody beautiful. I could have gone back and sat at home and, well, sat at Charlotte's house. But to be honest, I was just like, no. Go out, go for a drive. I'm, I'm not, I'm kind of a few miles away from where Charlotte lives, because I was like, I may as well go, go for a nice drive in my car. Because obviously I've not had the car for very long. I've put a Q&A up on my Instagram, so I'll be answering that fairly soon. I was just like, just go and, and edit and enjoy yourself. I'm sipping on a monster. I'm sat up in the park in a t-shirt and shorts. Having a great time. And you should be able to enjoy your own company, you know? It's all well and good having girlfriends and families and all this kind of stuff, but there are times when you just need to sit by yourself and little did I know, this is just what I needed right now. I'm having a great time just sat editing my video, talking to you guys, doing my thing, you know, because this is what I love doing the most out of anything. I love creating YouTube videos. I love creating content. I love going to the gym and this allows me to do it kind of all in one go and connect with people from all over the freaking world and this muscle food thing if you follow my Instagram I uh, did a takeover on muscle food Instagram stories um, a couple days ago now and it was a ridiculous experience it was 
I, I literally, I had the chance, the opportunity, because Muscle Food is, is a big company, right? I've used the, used the company for years, and Muscle Food is a massive, massive company that obviously can reach a massive amount of people. And I'm used to just putting up an Instagram story, you know, a few hundred people seeing it and stuff like that. And within like minutes, there was like two, three thousand people watching these stories that I was putting up. And I was like, this is mad. This is, this is insane. Like the massive reach of people that you can get. And social media has the power to do that. And it's really, really, weird and wonderful like social media is this still brand new phenomenon and it's just my favorite thing to do i can't think of anything that i would rather do than this and i'm just sat here in a park with my laptop out sipping on a monster hmm it's the thin the simple things eh it's funny you know i've had a really good day and I had no idea how today was going to turn out. I didn't know, for one, I didn't know um, how much time I was going to get to spend with Jake. Um, I had a little bit longer than I thought, so number one, that was really good. Number two, I didn't know how good the session was going to go because commercial gym and versus home gym. I'm going to do a video on that, by the way. Um, the Instagram poll has definitely voted for a, a yes on the, um, on the gym versus uh, video, so that is coming. And now I'm just sat here having a good time talking to you guys. I feel like I'm repeating myself, but um, this whole social media thing and this whole talking to a camera thing is weird, yeah. But it is a chance for me to not vent. Vent is the wrong word because venting is when you're angry, you know. It's just a chance for me to talk. Talk to people all over the world, all at the same time. And share my experiences a chance for you guys to share your own experiences in the comment sections and stuff like that social media is freaking awesome it's mad when you really think about it social media is really really mad and a weird thing to be doing yes i understand i've just been stared at over there <laughs> oh dear oh you know what christian guzman in his um, in his intro, not in intro, his first summer shredding video of the year, he put up a really old clip, and I remember seeing this video sort of five years ago. Um, he put up a really old clip saying, "Oh, I'm talking to a camera, blah blah blah. I'm obviously doing it for a purpose." And like, yeah, that's 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 spot on. People just don't seem to get it, you know. Even recording in a, in a gym, like if you have a word with someone, "Oh, I'm just about to record this," like, is that okay? Do you want to move out the way and all that kind of stuff, or? can I just film people kind of look at you like an alien social media is still and YouTube in particular because if you talk to a phone it's completely different you know people film snapchats and Instagram stories wherever they go but if you're talking to a big camera like this on a gorilla pod like hold up on a gorilla pod like like this you know it is it, it's weird <laughs> it's very very weird um, and people just aren't used to it yet, and you do get some funny looks, but it's all for a purpose. It's all for the greater good, shall we say. Hmm. I'm so content right now. Appreciate the little things in life, guys, because you don't know how long it's gonna last. Everything could change. The click of a finger, everything could change. And you would have no control over it. You just have to put up with it because it's reality and that's how life works. It's crap, but that's how it is. So appreciate life for what it is. I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. Um, I'm kind of mellowed it out right now though. Let me know what you think about this kind of raw, just venting to the camera. Let me know in the comments. I uh, appreciate all your support on the Muscle Food Takeover, that was absolutely mad. Thank you and welcome to, to the family, to all the new people because I'm very excited to show you everything that we have to come. We've got body power coming up and a few more things that I'll keep under wraps. 
So thank you very much for watching guys. If you have enjoyed, drop a like. It will really help the channel out. Comment down below and subscribe if you are new. It would really mean a lot. Thank you very much. Together we will grow and I will see you in the next one.